yesterday but a big storm came here in Okinawa so I ended up not but now we're gonna go handle our business I'm gonna go run some errands and I'm bringing y'all with me hold on y'all I'm trying to put my mask on because <sighs> in my apartment building there's a lot of older people and you just never know some people have COVID and like don't even know it so I'm just trying to make sure I'm being safe for my elders. So I'm putting my mask on. Just got to the first floor. So let's go get in the car. Y'all, so I just got in the car and my freaking key is dead. Like, it's not even showing. Oh, I'm going to have to go all the way back upstairs to get CJ key because this key is freaking dead. I'll be back. Let me go upstairs and get the key. All right, y'all. So I got the key and ooh, I'm back in the car. So pretty much we're just finna go run some errands. I'm finna pick up my baby some Valentine's Day gifts. I'm finna get my husband some Valentine's Day gifts. And then I gotta get some yen because I gotta go pay my phone bill, my power bill, and my, um, oh, that's it. My phone bill, power bill. So I gotta get some money out and just run some errands. I'm so glad that I'm finally driving over here, y'all. We've been here almost six months and I'm just now starting to feel comfortable with driving here. Like, it was just so... This is why I hate sharing the car. Every time you gotta get, you gotta readjust this stuff. It was just so, like, weird driving on the wrong side of the road to me. Like, they drive on the left side here. So that's why I say wrong side of the road. But this car is so dirty. Like, it needs to be cleaned bad. And I need to take my hair down bad, but I'm finna listen to some music. So I'm gonna hit y'all up when we get this stuff. Okay, y'all. So I'm just on the way to um, the base. So if you, if your family is military and y'all get stationed in Okinawa, like Kadena Air Force Base is literally like um, my Walmart, my Target, my mall because it's the biggest of course the air force to me they always have the best bases my husband and i stationed there but that's the base like we always utilize my husband is stationed on one of the smaller bases but why is it cold up in this car so i'm just driving there and i just want to say like i'm so proud of myself y'all because like a my bad y'all but like a month ago i would have not been doing this like i would not been driving like but my husband's gonna have surgery next week so i was like i gotta get it together like i gotta figure out how to maneuver around because he's gonna be down for like a week or two so i was like mm -mm. i'm gonna have to figure something out like we're gonna have to make some shake i'm gonna have to get in his car and just drive because it's okay sorry y'all my phone had failed but essentially he's about to have surgery and we still like have to live you know like carter's still gonna need milk we still gonna need groceries excuse my nails y'all i have a nail appointment on valentine's day but i was like i'm just gonna get in the car we just gonna do this so pretty much i feel way more confident not even 100 percent confident definitely not 100 percent, but i feel way more confident than i was with driving here so with that being said sometimes in life i just feel like you have to just do things like you just have to get out of your comfort zone the main thing here for me basically was like driving on the wrong side of the road they street signs and stuff being japanese so i don't know like it's like learning how to drive all the way over again and i feel like when we move back home i'm gonna have to learn how to drive at home again because this is gonna be what i'm used to but um what was i gonna say but yes y'all so oh my lord these people be slamming on brakes and it'd be so many car accidents but like everybody got like a little cheap knock 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 ding ding car over here so nobody really don't be caring but still it's like still be accidents all the time like i'm looking at an accident right now which is why i'm in this standstill traffic because somebody didn't rear in somebody but yeah yeah y'all probably tired of hearing me rent so i'll be back all right y'all so i finally got here and got through the gate y'all it was like an accident at the gate so i kind of had to wait um 
for like 10 minutes to get in. So I'm putting my mask on right now. And of course, I'm finna double up. Cause I don't play with this COVID stuff. Like, I don't have no time for it. Oh, somebody coming out here with some roses. They got roses in here. I need my husband to come get some. Cause they never have roses here, y'all. Like flowers, like bouquet of flowers, they never have. Uh, anyways, y'all, I'm gonna go get my money, go pay my bill, and then I'll see y'all in the store. Y'all, we're at home. I'm about to let CJ go downstairs and get the bags because it started raining and I'm not gonna get wet up, so my air is already frizzy and stuff. So I'm the elevator. And part is up, so I'm gonna show y'all him. Say hi! So guys, he just got up from his nap. Him and his daddy was in here taking a nap, child. I got the living room looking trashed. But um, CJ just went downstairs to get the stuff because I had too much stuff and it was raining and I just was not up for it. So my husband going to get the stuff. So I'm going to make dinner, which I told y'all I'm making taco soup. And then I'm about to, I'm probably going to go ahead and give Carter his stuff because I, I just cannot wait. If it ain't Christmas, I just don't feel like you have to wait until the official day. So I'm going to go ahead and give my baby his stuff. And yeah. I'm going to take you out to the store with me because the store like literally right by my house. I was going to walk. Um, I was going to put the car in his little wagon. The store right there. The little green store. But since it's raining, I'm not going to walk anymore. I'm going to drive because I have to pay my power bill. I wanted to get some footage driving for y'all. But y'all are not that good of a driver to be driving and um recording yet. So, yes, yeah, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, y'all, so I told you I was making this taco soup. So this is pretty much everything you need. Some chips, taco meat, ranch seasoning, taco seasoning, cream cheese, beef broth. You can use kidney beans. I use kidney beans and pinto beans. And I use two cans of Rotel. You could use um just diced tomatoes if you want to. I just like the green chilies a little bit better. And I got two things of corn. And basically, this is like a one pot thing. You can put this in your slow cooker if you want to, but I'm not doing all that. It's going to be quick and easy. Mm, so, yeah. Say hey, babe. Oh! How you doing? You're so freaking old. Carter got my house in a mess. It's all his stuff. He just opened up all his little Valentine's Day stuff. And he already got... A trampoline, a basketball goal, a whole toy box in my living room full of toys. I really need to stop buying him all this stuff. But it's alright. He the only child. It'll suffice, I guess. So he get a sibling. <laughs> Carter, can you say hey? Say hi. He in the donut right now. So this is new stuff. Buy house 7 Eleven right there in the cut. We're gonna go over there and see what they got. I guess I'll take y'all with me. Wow! Wow! <laughs> wow! It's amazing, right? Yes, it's amazing. Yeah! Y'all hear Carter? He just yelled. Wow! He did too! Oh my gosh. Wow! Wow! You want some snacks? Beef jerky. Yeah, it's it's okay. yeah. Yeah. Baked cheese. Cheese yeah. and pie. Case. Dried squid. Salmon jerky. Yeah. I'm going to try these. Yeah. These so nasty. Let me see. Yeah, some more too. They got meat, they got curry in here. Medium spicy beef curry, vegetable curry. Well, you cook, you just take it home with I mean, free curry. All right, Coco's, I got some combo to you. Wow! Try to really. But look at this almonds and dried fish. That's fucking wild. Roasted walnuts, roasted almonds. 
get it, Connor. You like it here. Those are walnuts, baby. You don't want that. Guys, so nice and clean. They got a new Fanta. Oh, oh, the normal Fanta. Only if it tastes better in the bottle. And look at that. What's that? Give me a melon. Yeah. Look at the one on the end, though. I can't read this shit. Oh, my God. I guess I'll kick it up. I want somebody to On these balloons. Carter. Alright, y'all, we just got home. That's 7 Eleven. <laughs> they really crunk in there like it's Applebee's or something. But I don't know. I got some kind of chicken. So, I think so. It looked like this. I don't know what it is, but let's just yeah. see. Well, hello all. I am the king of Fruity Land, but I go by another name too. We know. It's Tommy. We know. Oh, for you. I have lived here since yep. I was Back a in the bag. child. We know. I suppose you were wondering yep. how do I sustain my life? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> That's a technical difficulty. So, the taste is not the problem. The problem is the texture. It's almost slimy. Like, it's like... It's literally slimy. I don't like no slimy food. What does it taste like? It tastes like... Like smoked... Grilled barbecue chicken, maybe? You gonna make it for another bite? I was just trying to see if the whole thing is like slimy. Which it is. That's what scare me about trying new stuff, y'all, because I don't like when it feel weird like this. Like, what is this? What is it? Like, I used Google Translate in the store, and it said something about chicken. So I was like, okay, well, it's chicken, and it looked, like, good, like chicken on a stick. But it's good. The flavor is there, definitely. But you want to try it? Come on, try it for the camera. Come on. I'll try that shit for the camera. Come on. For the tube. Come on. Don't smell it. Should it smell like a barbecue? Yeah, I told you it smells like, like smoked barbecue chicken. The flavor is very good. It's just the texture. So good. It's slimy though. You didn't taste it. I can't. I don't like smell. Well, yeah, yeah, I'm about to cook, so. You want this? No. All right, y'all. Welcome back to my kitchen. It looks much more different the last time y'all seen it. Last time y'all seen my kitchen was at Christmas time. Since then, I added this marble contact backsplash looking thing. And then, and then I contact papered my cabinets. Because as y'all know, they were see-through. So basically, we're just going to cook. So yes, the first step, you want to get like a little, oh my lord, it's burnt, a skillet. And you're gonna wanna brown your hamburger meat with some diced onion in the in the uh, skillet. So let's do that.
day. I was supposed to go somewhere last night, but we didn't because we was tired. So we just on the walk. Pretty much, it's a rainy, ugly day. And there ain't really nothing for us to do. So we just tried to get Carter out the house for a little bit. Dang, these trees so small. Yeah, it's Valentine's Day, and <clears throat> we pretty much didn't really do nothing. This light is giving such a weird glare in my glasses. We didn't really do nothing for real. I just went and got my nails done, and it's 9.50 p.m., and like around like 11 ish, we might go to the store. We would literally be having to go out that late to avoid the crowds, and it still be a crowd in the store sometimes at that time, so. If we go, I'm going to take y'all, you know, with me. But today, I pretty much just got my nails done. And I vlogged, you know, me getting my nails done. And then we pretty much came home, took a big fat nap, and got up about 7.50. And now we're just parlaying around the house. Pretty much not doing nothing. So, I'm going to end this vlog today because it's been like two or three days and it's dead now so if we don't go to the store i'm gonna come back and close out the video <sighs> but i don't know i'll catch up with y'all store y'all and it's like about to be midnight look at that some louis vuitton the guys are leaving me bye babe bye bye so fucking rude So this is a store that kind of just sells a little bit of everything, like literally designer, clothes, shoes, electronics, everything. Yeah, I heard y'all. Oh, that looks so cute. You should get these vapor mats. Wonder? No, you I got them. <laughs> Y'all look at these. These are so cute. And then this so this is like a skincare fridge. But for like 138, I do not want to pay that much for that. And I think these are so cute. Like for your vanity. And then I think these are like nail dryers for your gel polish. But I don't be doing my own nails, so I don't really need nothing from over here. They be having such cool like hair tools and stuff mm -hmm. i want to try something mm -hmm. i want a curling one <laughs> but i just don't know like what's a good brand mm -hmm. like what what brands of the japanese stuff is good you know i don't want to waste no money like they got expensive ones they got some cheap ones these are like eight dollars i just don't know y'all these blow dryers look precarious <laughs> And just more hair tools, y'all. So I'll be back, y'all. Okay, y'all. I think I just found a Japanese dupe for the Dr. Bomber soap. Because I just smelled it. And it smells just like Dr. Bomber. So I'm going to get one. 
and just pretty much just try it out. Pretty small bottle for ten dollars, but I've been missing my doctor bonus. <laughs> I'm gonna try this. Just looking for some stuff, y'all. I was just looking for stuff. Just shit to try. All right, y'all. So that pretty much concludes this vlog, y'all. Y'all asked for a vlog, so I was just trying to, you know. And give y'all one. Y'all see my life is pretty boring. That's why we had to stretch them out for several days. But yes, it's like 12. What time is it? It's like 12.30. We just got home. 12.45. 12.45. We be up all night. So us being out late, you know, it just works for us. Then I got to go to work in the morning. But like the video, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> there you go. So that, that's all y'all. I pretty much don't got something I'm talking about. That's all y'all. We'll see y'all in the next video. I'm going to be more active. I'm going to be in more videos, guys. <laughs> Love y'all. <laughs>